We'll take a call from Mary in Pennsylvania. Mary, welcome to Bobby Likas Car Clinic. Uh, hi, Bobby. Hi. I have a quick question. Sure. Is there um, spark plugs in the Honda? I have a six, um, an 04 CRV. Yes, ma'am. There is. Yes, ma'am. Well, how often do you have to have maintenance on that? Well, that's a good question. You know, uh, at, at number one, the first thing you do, do you have the happen to have the owner's manual? I mean, you know, in the car. I mean, do you have that? Uh, there is one in the okay. car. In, in the owner's well, the, and, and usually owner's manuals are uh, rarely read, but uh, it, except when you buy a new car and you're trying to figure out what that button does over there. Right. <laughs> but but uh, in in the owner's manual. Uh, there's a, a, a maintenance category that normally starts off at uh, 5,000, uh, 15,000, 30,000, and 60,000, and 90,000. Uh, for you to remember, regardless of what make car you drive or in, in the future that you buy, you, you want to know that annual inspections, which our industry doesn't promote but should, are absolutely essential to knowing the condition of any car regardless of the miles or time driven on that car annual inspections it's one of our best no it's the best service that we come up have come up with and that we provide our car clinic service pre-repair which is the prevention of repair this is our trademarked program for and, and the reason that that's such a great program is that number one for new customers it allows an introduction between the car and the technician. So the technician says, oh, I've never seen this car before. I'm going to do an annual inspection, and we have an 80-point codified checklist and the, the, it either says repair or not repair. And it is a fantastic form that we've created, and we actually are protected because we, 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 uh, we have a lot of time and energy and, and investment there. In addition to the annual inspection or on the annual inspection form, Mary, Let's say that number 42 on the 80 list was the check the tag light or check for oil leak. And so if it there's an oil leak, the technician puts a check mark. Now, then it goes over to the comment section and puts the number down 42 or whatever I just said, what same number and uh -huh, and says 42 valve covers leaking or rear main leaking or bottom of engine wet with oil needs uh, cleaning to pinpoint oil leak. So this service uh, allows for, and we charge $90 for this service, it, it allows our technician to become familiar with a car that we've never serviced, which is a great uh, connection to new customers. It's a great tool for our existing customer base that comes in, they come in regularly, and we do all the services regularly. However, every year, I mean, you brush your teeth regularly, but you need to get them cleaned seriously every six months. So mm -hmm. we uh, offer the annual inspection. That, that's a, a really important. And the reason that I bring this up, and how does it apply to your 04 CRV? Your car could have, being an 04 model, it could have 100,000 miles or it could have 30,000 miles. And the difference between the needs of your car have nothing to do with what's printed in any book anywhere or at any shop anywhere. It's the current condition of the car you drive and how you drive it and where you drive it and the environment in which it's driven. Does that, that make sense? Yes, it does. So your car is unlike any other car, just like it. And if your neighbor's got a black one and you got a blue one and they were made on the same assembly line the same day, they are not owned, driven, and, and maintained by the same people. Ergo... They're two different cars under two different environments, and they're in two different conditions and state of, of, of health. Does that make sense? Yes, it does. Well, my dear, yeah, that's as much does. as I can okay, cram um, into our time together. I'm going to take a short commercial break, come back and answer more questions. Mary, you and everyone else, don't touch that dial. Stay tuned. We've got a lot more information coming up. <laughs> 